Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. On today's episode, I'm going to show you how to sync your Google Contacts with your iOS device. So this is a question I get asked a lot. When you add a Gmail account to your iPhone or your iPad, you can see your calendars and you can certainly see your email, but it doesn't sync contacts. Any Google Contacts you have will not appear and you can't add any to your Google Contacts. Well, you can actually solve this problem by adding a second Google account. You can use the same Google ID and password, but adding a special one that just handles contacts. And I found this very easily by looking at some of the useful information at Apple's site. You can go to this page for uh, a description of what you need to do. So I'm going to use my iPad for this, but certainly a lot of people want to do this on their iPhone and the steps are exactly the same. I'm going to go into Settings and under Settings I'm going to click on or tap on Mail Contacts Calendars and I can see I've got my iCloud account, uh, my work account, and a Gmail account. Now I'm going to look at my Gmail account here. It's a sample email account uh, and you can see that I've got Mail turned on, Calendars turned on, and Notes turned on. I don't have the ability to add contacts which is the frustrating thing for people. So how do you fix that? Well, the way you fix that is to add a new account. Let's add an account here. And instead of choosing one of these, I'm going to choose other at the bottom, and I'm going to choose a contacts account, a card DAV account right there. And according to the instructions from Apple, I'm going to use Google as the server, google.com, and I'm going to enter my username and password. Now, since this is actually a, a Gmail account, uh, not a Google Apps account, I can actually use just the part before the at symbol. And then I can enter my password. Then I hit next and it'll quickly verify the account. So now that I've got that, as you can see, it added and it's just a contacts account. It even says so right there under Google. Um, I can make things a little easier by changing the name of this account. Let's change the description uh, to Google Contacts and hit done. Now when I go into my Contacts app, I'll see the contacts appear there. I put two sample contacts in uh, there. If I look tap on groups there at the top you can see I've got my iCloud uh, account there and I've turned that off for this demonstration. So all you see is Google Contacts. That's the name that I just entered in and I can see that I've selected yes, yeah, show all Google Contacts which is what I'm seeing here. And I can add new ones and change them and it will sync with my Google account. So this is very handy if you want to use an iOS device but you're using Google's cloud services, not iCloud. Uh, you can do this and have your contacts sync as well as your mail and calendars and notes. Hope you found this useful. Till next time, this is Gary with MacMost Now. If you found this video useful, there's one thing you can do for me in return. It won't cost you anything and it will just take you a few seconds. If you're not already at MacMost.com, go there and then look for the video you just watched and go to that page. Underneath the video you'll see a bunch of different links that help you share the video with friends. Take a second to click the like button. This sends a signal out to the rest of the internet that the video is worth watching. Thanks.